Burrell can keep the game going, but did he ever really have the big secret, the ace card, the George Smith rape tape recorded by Diana? Or was it a magnificent bluff? Was it all a house of cards? Al Nevins, Paul's agent, had told me that Paul wouldn't talk to me, but I needed to try. It's just up here, I think. I think this is the area right here. All the houses look absolutely the same. Yeah, that's Florida. <laughs> There's a sign that says, beware. Obviously in, because uh, his car's there, uh, but he won't answer the door. As Paul would say, it would only be polite to move on. Paul Burrell was never a butler. He was a poker player, a working-class lad who travelled from a mining village to running a million-pound industry. Based on what? Telling us he knew something but never revealing his hand. Maybe he does have something amazing up his sleeve. Maybe it's the rape tape, or maybe it's something else entirely. Or maybe he was bluffing all along, and everyone believed him, even the Queen of England. And if that's the case, what a truly brilliant poker player he has been. You got it? I got it, I got it! Ah! So, what does the man himself think? Paul Burrell's story is next, in his own words.